The Speaker of the U.S. Department of Defense, General Patrick Ryder, has said that the first two batteries of Norwegian SAMs will be delivered to Ukraine by the 16th of November. This is the deadline set by the Pentagon. The United States has signed a contract with Raytheon Missiles and Defense for the purchase of NASAMs for Ukraine. Its total cost is $180 million. According to the expert, the US will transfer the air defense systems to Ukraine secretly and at an accelerated pace. That is why November 16th is a tentative date, most likely the delivery will take place much earlier. The form of the contract for their purchase hints at that. The Speaker of the Air Force's command of the AFU stated that NASAMs will strengthen Ukraine's defense, but only if there are enough systems to cover the entire territory. It is not enough, but two batteries can simultaneously destroy 72 fired missiles. First of all it is necessary to secure the nuclear power plants from a possible disaster. Information about the supply of the aforementioned Norwegian-made air defense systems began to spread after Zelensky's statement in an interview with CBS. The president said, we absolutely need the United States to show leadership and transfer air defense systems to Ukraine. I want to thank President Biden and Congress for the positive decision, which has already been approved. We got NASAMs. As Nikiforov clarified, Zelensky implied the decision on the deliveries. At the same time, the president added that the air defense systems allocated to Ukraine are not enough for full protection against bombing by the occupants. We need to secure civilian infrastructure, schools, hospitals, universities and residential buildings, which is a large area. Ukraine has not yet physically received the mobile anti-aircraft missile systems NASAMs. Deliveries have not yet taken place, but there is a decision to approve them. This comment was made by the spokesman of Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky Sergei Nikiforov. We received a decision, we received approval, but NASAMs themselves have not yet physically arrived, Nikiforov said.